I really don't make these kind of videos anymore, but I thought since I had some stuff that I found today, and my foot is stuck in a cable, okay, <laughs> that I would uh, go ahead and share the this stuff. So, uh, one of the things, um, besides a Famicom Mini, one of the things uh, I found today is this Dance Dance Revolution Disney Mix. Now, I think this is the same version that was on the N64 in Japan. This would then be the American release. It says it's by both Buena Vista Games, which is Disney, and Konami. So here it is. I don't know if it works, and I don't have any batteries to plug it in. But uh, as we can tell, there's, um, or as I can see anyways, there's a power and a reset button. And then it goes to, uh, this is a, a first, stereo AV cables. Usually these plug and play games are mono. Above that, I collect Monopolies and the um, resale value is really good. I buy them for two bucks, three bucks at a thrift store and um, they immediately go up in price right after I bought them. Okay, over here, because the Nintendo Switch is coming out, a lot of stores, Game Stops, um, Walmart, Toys R Us are all doing clearances. Don't buy this at Toys R Us. It's $40. This is $15 at Walmart. It's Guiana Sisters Twisted Dreams. It says Director's Cut. I don't know how you can cut a game since that means film. The Amazing Spider-Man 2. $7 at Walmart. I think Activision lost the Marvel license to Capcom for a few months. Lego Star Wars, The Complete Saga. This was um, $9 at Walmart, brand new. Wreck-It Ralph. And then I found Indiana Jones here, and GameStop was clearing this one out for $7. Not brand new, but hey. Also, uh, Disney Store, yeah, you can see me in the reflection, had, uh, what's his name here? C2B5 Diecast Metal. On sale. I don't know what movie this or franchise this droid is from. And then moving on, Harley Quinn toys. So uh, here's from the DC Superhero Girls. I didn't know she was a superhero. This one's an action figure line. In a weird way, it's legacy. This will be compatible with superpowers. You know, it's the old. Uh, 70s stuff. Um, about superpowers, let's go behind these Star Wars figures. Right there, the Hall of Justice. So, in some weird way, this one will work with the Hall of Justice characters I have from 30 to 35 years ago when I was a child. This is uh, Scalers, don't really know, never opened one, so I don't know. And Harley Quinn, then and now. Um, I believe these are both made by Mattel. This is Harley Quinn Barbie. And uh, this is Harley Quinn Today for the DC, what's it called? DC Superhero Girls. That's a charging cable for the PS4. <laughs> Super Mario Brothers Skin. Found this at a store on clearance. And uh, there you go. For the Wii U gamepad if you want to add a little pizzazz. And finally, I got, as you can tell by, it says clearance right there. I got a Robin Amiibo for Smash Brothers and three Amiibo right there for um, Animal Crossing. Including, I believe his name is K.K. Ryder. Slider? <laughs> I don't know. Am I thinking of C.C. Ryder from Elvis? And if you're just interested, various Nintendo posters from the years. Alright, oh yeah, there is a PS2 box over there. At the same time, there's also a <laughs> Wii U Disney Infinity. So, okay, well, I hope you people like this.